Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. Today let's see how to make the click activity dynamic to select a particular date in Google Calendar. I have already created a sequence and made it a start node by attaching it with start. Let's create a string variable to store the value of date. Provide value as November 18, 2023. Close the variable panel and double click on the created sequence. To split our date into day, month, and year, we will use multiple assign activity. Create three variables to store day, month, and year by pressing Ctrl plus K in the save to section and for the value to save provide value as split which is a function and provide values, the first is the string which we need to split and second the separator which is space. Now day is out first value so specify zero in bracket and convert the whole statement to string. Continue this for the remaining two just changing position value as one and two. Next drag and drop the click activity and click on indicate on screen. Click on any date on the calendar. Now click on edit selector from options menu and click open and open in UI Explorer. We clicked on date 23 which is shown as a name click on checkbox to include that. We also need to look for a web control that includes month and year. Check that checkbox also. Include inner text value. Leaving the month and year value delete all text till the asterisk symbol. If you click on validate you will see it will still work. To make the day value dynamic click on 23, select it and right click on it and choose variable and assign as the created date value which is date 1. Click on save button. It will not validate but that will cause an issue because the value is not currently assigned. Click on run file from debug file. As you can see it clicked on November 18th. Now, consider if we change the month to December then we need to click on next button. Open UI Explorer again. Edit month and year in both title and inner text.
Edit variables value from November to December. Add try-catch activity to check if the month matches with the provided value. Place the click activity inside the try section. To continue the process of clicking until the desired date's condition is met drag and drop while loop. Drag the entire try block inside the body of while loop. For the condition create variable and assign its value as true. Inside the catch section add the exception named system.exception. Drag and drop click activity and click on indicate on screen. Select the next button. Now, when the required date is met we need to exit the loop so drag and drop an assign activity and change the value of variable to false. Click on run file from debug file drop down. As you can see the process executed accurately. If you like the content of this video make sure to subscribe to my channel.